What's up guys? We're here in Portugal for a different kind of vlog, enjoying the beach, eating some pastel right here at the coast uh, in Kashka. Just kidding, we're here for the ATP 250 in Estoril. Today I'm giving my singles ATP debut. Good man, good job. Yeah, ciao. Alles klar, ciao. I got uh, an alternate spot for the singles qualifying, so we'll kick off the tournament a bit early and then we go for doubles on uh, Tuesday or Wednesday. from the practice course it's a uh, Monday morning we just had our uh, first hit we had to go indoors because uh, it rained again a bit this morning it has been raining like crazy in Portugal so even like 10 minutes of rain made the course very wet but uh, yeah we just had a good hit one hour good intensity we're gonna go to the gym now and uh, yeah then we have a second session playing points for 90 minutes in the afternoon and uh, most likely outdoors Before the second hit, we're going to have lunch. The lunch is very nice here. Many options, it tastes amazing. I think one of the best foods I've ever had at a tournament. Uh, even very high for ATP Tour standards. And uh, yeah, then have some coffee, maybe check out some of the other matches. Overall, the vibe is very good here. Having a great time and uh, yeah, looking forward to play very soon though. ATP tournament of Estoril. This will be the last year probably that this tournament is happening. So very happy uh, to be a part of it this year. Very happy to be back uh, playing at 250 tournaments. Uh, we started the clay season uh, in Zadar in Naples. I actually flew here directly from Naples. It's uh, very nice here, very nice sight. You'll see that throughout the vlog, but uh, it's also quite windy. So not easy conditions, but very typical for March, April in Europe. And yeah, we're practicing well already, a bit indoors, a bit outdoors. So you will see a lot of that footage, footage as well. And uh, yeah, we'll probably kick it off on uh, Tuesday with our first match. So stay tuned for a lot of content uh, coming. And uh, yeah, you'll see what's going on in Estoril at the ATP 250. Enjoy. Hey guys, it's Tuesday in Estoril, we were supposed to play today, but uh, yeah, obviously it's raining, so our match got cancelled, so we're back in the gym as usually, and uh, yeah, stay tuned, I hope we start playing tomorrow.
And obviously uh, during rain delay, when we go to the gym, it's very nice to have a great setup like here. We can really train hard. Uh, today we're doing footwork and some chest. Let's go. Play some points now with a doubles team. It's probably our last practice uh, before we start the tournament, so let's go. And we're going to be mic'd up today. Wednesday, after a few days of rain delay, we're finally here. We use those days uh, to prepare, work good in the gym, on the tennis court. And uh, now we're finally here. We're going to play the last match today. Uh, yeah, wish us luck, wish us support. And now get ready for some warm up and match play. What's up guys, as you can see we're 10,000 feet above the ground as everybody likes to say. Unfortunately we lost yesterday uh, the first round in Estoril, it was a heartbreaking loss. 6-7, uh, 7-6, seven, 8-10, seven, uh, we even were up 8-6 in the deciding match tie break. Yeah, but we couldn't get the win. It has been yeah, definitely a tough first quarter of the year, losing many close matches. Uh, many of those matches we've won last year. But nonetheless, uh, we're playing a very good level and now we're playing the biggest tournaments in the world. So we're competing against uh, some of the best players in the world. So that means small margins. And I'm very confident that quite soon we will find the block uh, or to turn it around and to win those uh, close matches and to make big results at the big tournaments. Nonetheless, it was a very good week in Estoril. Off court, we trained well had a lot of fun. Also Julian, my videographer, business partner was with me. So yeah, we had a great time. Also training good in the gym, trying some new uh, nutritional things uh, to even more improve the performance. And yeah, it's a pity to have lost so early in Estoril. Not really what we were hoping for, but uh, yeah, that's sports and uh, gotta have a short term memory now for losses and uh, the next big chance is coming around in two weeks playing the bmw open in munich uh, it's kind of in front of our home crowd a lot of family and friends will be there and uh, yeah now it's time to prepare for that and uh, attack there and uh, stay tuned and you will find out what happens in munich very soon <laughs> <laughs> 